So on my last video, I got requested to show what we're doing. So obviously she got the new headlights in. Um, these are the turn signals that she's getting with it. So as you can see, they're on both top and bottom. Usually it's just the bottom. Gotta turn it. All right, blinker on. And they're not doing it. There we go, didn't have the key far enough. So we're going to the sequential like this. So as you can see there. So if you key us on what we're doing. So these are how they came, they came together. Uh, this was connected with this. And then this will sit right into your socket on the side. So if you come over here, obviously you have your top and bottom. You're gonna have to drill a hole in the bottom. Then we want, when we mount them in, it's kind of hard to see. I don't want to take the grill off by myself. We're gonna pair the black with the black and the red with the blue, and they're plug and play. All right, so this is part two. Obviously, we got the right side done and the left side. In case you're wondering what you need, you need a 13 millimeter long socket to get the bolts out from behind here. You're gonna need a drill bit. Not sure the size because we kind of improvised um, what we did for ours. It's not ideal, but um, we used a PH2 impact, uh, whatever you wanna call them, and a 16 bolt from the bumper of the white truck. So this is how they look. See the bars all lit up? There's the right side. Oh, there they go, they're all lit up now. There's the left side. And the right side. Actually be backwards. A pretty easy installation. The only wiring we had to do was for the bars. And in order to do that, what we did is, you can see the black and red wires down there. We had to splice into each. So what we did, is you can't see it on this one because the headlights are in here. But we spliced into the low beam and grounded it within the red and black. And then for the top bars to work, we went into the same wires, the red and black, connected them all together. And we had to go out and buy some clips, just a little splice kit that you can get. They're like five bucks at O'Reilly's. And that is the whole project. I'll take some pictures once we get it all put together. All right, here's it all put together. Turn the light on. My on. There's the right and the left. Put your hazards on. There you go. All put together. She got these from where'd you get them from? AZ VH Auto. VH Auto. If I find the website, I'll put it in the description below. Um, if you're wondering what LEDs we're running. I believe they're called Farn, Farin. I'll have to look it up and put them in the description as well. And my silver truck, she has them in this truck. It's what she's planning on getting for her Honda and her red truck, and what I have in my blue truck. So we really like them. I highly recommend them. If you want a full tour of this truck, just let us know. Thanks for watching.